I was all ready, you know, for the World Cup. Just wasn't meant to be, you know. Denmark beat us fair and square. But I've been doing a lot of soul searching, you know. Who should we support as a nation? What team should we rally and get behind? It's not going to be Denmark, I can tell you that. And I know there's 800 years of history between us, but they're our nearest neighbour, right? We bloody support all the teams over there. We're always rabbiting on about how good the Premier League is. So why not get behind our neighbours, you know? Cheer on the boys in white and red. I've been practising, you know. They're not loud enough for the neighbours to hear me, but just loud enough that I can get it right, right? Listen. Fuck off, ref! Fuck off! You're having a fucking laugh, mate! You're having a right fucking laugh! Needs a bit of work, granted, right? But I could be there, you know, cheering on the, the three lines. You want some? You fucking want some? Would well, well, that be if you were at the match, right? But I'm on about at home, you know, you don't have to do that in front of the wife and the kids or anything. You can just do the whole... It's a bloody jolly good game, isn't it, guys? Jolly good game! You know, and then there's the songs, you know? Like, look, you're never gonna get classics like... We're all part of Jackie's song. Hey. But they do have, you know, songs like... We'll go on getting back, it's on getting back, it's on getting back, it's on getting back. You know, and, and this year I'm sure they have another brilliant song. <laughs> What's 800 years between neighbours, you know? Let bygones be bygones. The past is in the past. Let's move forward. Why not support them? You know, we're not in the bloody competition. They've got so many big household names, the likes of... Oxfordshire Chamberlain and, 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 and Loftus Cheek and all these really superb players, like household names. Let's rally behind them, you know? There's this one guy as well, I've forgotten his name, but, but I'm sure he's a massive star. Uh, and he's got a tattoo on his leg, and it's after causing a little bit of controversy in the camp. So he's probably going through a rough time, you know? The Irish fans would all get behind him, you know? Make up chants like. On your leg you got a tattoo of a gun Tell the boys it was just a bit of fun But maybe you were out too long in the sun So look, let's all do this Let's get behind our neighbours You know, put everything behind us Let's do this, you know This is an urgent appeal I want all Irish fans to start supporting England right now You can do... Hello? Well, I just did, um, yeah, I was going to go see the game, the, the English game, what, no, not, not, not to laugh at him, like, I was thinking we, uh, uh, yeah, I know, yeah, I, 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 I think they're shit too, yeah, just, just want to ask something, does, does everyone in the group think they're shit, or is it just me and you, or, Every, everyone <laughs> taught that, yeah, yeah. Ah, that's grand, right? Hey, see you down there, yeah. Bye, 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 bye. I think, I think it'll start supporting Iceland. Um, total underdogs. Uh, one fellow works in a chip shop, one fellow's in the, a bin, the bins, he collects the bins, so come on, Iceland! Woo! Two of a gun. Tell the boys it was just a bit of fun But maybe you were out too long in the sun You went to tattoo parlor said Give me a tattoo He said What do you want? I said I don't care it's up to you And it was all his fault He gave you the gun You didn't ask for it